this. You've probably seen me play this guitar in a few videos. This is my Charvel Toothpaste Logo 475. It's got active electronics, got the boost, three knob, five way switch. This is my number one. Um, I've told people before that when it comes to production guitars, mass produced guitars, you know, there's going to be one out of every, or maybe three out of every 50 that's just going to be different. They're going to be more solid, they're going to feel better, there's just going to be something about them. I've had a 375 and three 475s. I've still got my red 475 and it's nothing like this guitar. This guitar has a signature sound. The red one sounds more like a Les Paul. Uh, this neck is slimmer, faster, thinner than the red one. And I would say I've had I've got USA Jacksons. I've had Ernie Ball Music Men, um, the JP. I've had a Majesty. I've had some uh, higher end Japanese. Uh, th this neck reminds me a lot of an Ibanez 550 in that series. This neck reminds me a lot of the Ibanez. A lot of the Ibanez. This neck in particular feels a lot like the Wizard necks. Um, I would say this guitar, this is just one of those guitars that just, there's something different about it. I would say it holds its own against any USA Jackson. Um, the Ernie Ball was a great guitar. It was just too much guitar. And it was way too expensive to where I never felt comfortable playing it. Um, it's unfortunate I didn't buy more of these Charvels when you could buy them for two, three hundred dollars all day long. Um, if you were a manager of a music store, there were times when you traded in Model 4s that go for $1,500 now for 100 bucks, 150 You couldn't give them away. Um, you couldn't give these, you really can't give these things away now in the town I live in now. Um, they just, <clears throat> there's a niche group that buys these guitars and spends the money that they spend, but the money's well worth it because everyone knows that collected these Japanese Charvels and these Jacksons, you know, a few tweaks here and there, they're just as good as any American guitar. Um, for, you know, you're talking about $4,000 custom shop guitars versus a thousand, fifteen hundred, And you blindfold somebody and put them side by side, it's going to be real hard pressed to see which one it is if they're not familiar with the guitar. But yeah, this is my number one. Um, I play it over my USA, my 86 Jackson. I play it over the Model 4s. Um, my Model 5, this one and my Model 5 are my two favorites right now. <clears throat> my ESP, I love my ESP, but um, I just prefer a bolt-on neck. Um, the ESP is a neck three, and the ESP's got more of a Les Paul type neck. So, but for what the ESP, the ESP is, as old as it, as old as it is, it's staying, so... This is her. The, uh, I mean, out of all my guitars, it's got the best tone. It's got the best metal tone. Um, it's just, just a great guitar. Highly recommend a 475 toothpaste logo. Highly recommend it.